All right, here's a very handy tool for TV antennas, satellite dishes, and cable TV. This is the Coax Explorer 2, made by Klein Tools, and it's a coaxial cable testing tool that lets you map out the coax in your home and also test it for open or short circuits. It runs on two AAA batteries. This is a nice, easy tool to use to test the cable. Just going to remove these remote test leads from the onboard storage. We're going to use just one of them. We'll just set that one aside. It does come with a barrel adapter to connect it to one end of the coax cable. We'll do that first. Just twist that in there. Push the remote test lead on to one end of the cable like that. And the other end of the cable gets connected to the tester. Okay, that's all connected. And all you have to do is hold the test button down. And we're getting an open reading here. So that means that somewhere along this run of cable, the center conductor inside the coax is probably broken. So this cable should be replaced. Same thing if you receive a short reading. That means that somewhere along the cable, the center conductor and the braided shielding are touching. This cable should also be replaced. And if your cable's working properly, you're going to get a pass light on the corresponding color-coded remote lead you have connected. I'll just show you here in real time that this tester does read all of these individually which makes it really handy. There's the red. If you want to map out the cable run in your home, you can connect each of these little remote leads to the end of the cable in each room in your house, living room, bedroom, kitchen, wherever you have TVs, and then go down to the basement or wherever your splitter or amplifier is located and you can map out each individual cable so you know which cable run goes where and also at the same time test it for shorts or open circuits. These remote test leads are really handy because obviously in the real world you're not going to have both ends of a coax cable readily available like this for testing. One end is going to be in some room in the house and the other end is going to be down in the basement or utility room where your splitter or amplifier is located. So this makes it easy to map out the cables in your home and also verify that they're all in working order with no short or open circuits.